Kevin Chief. I played for the University of Winnipeg Westman men's basketball uh, program and team from 1993 to 1998. And it started with uh, a former phys ed teacher. His name was Al Kozak out of Isaac Newton Junior High. I won an athletic scholarship at that time which allowed me to come and attend the summer basketball camp here at the University of Winnipeg and one of my first coaches there is actually Kenny Opolko and I remember the opportunity to walk on to the, the court at the Duckworth Center in grade 7 and I've said this many times but it literally changed who I thought I could be and I think at that time it was a $50 scholarship that Isaac Moon invested to get me to come to the camp and I gotta tell you man I got a t-shirt that said Westman on it and that was it for me. It was a place that I really wanted to come and be part of. For someone like me, uh, the biggest barrier I had in my life is that, you know, I grew up on social assistance, uh, so my biggest challenge was dealing with being poor. And what the athletic scholarship did, even before I received it, it started when I was 13, 14 years old, is I was told by people, my teachers, my coaches, that if I worked hard, both on the court and in the classroom, one day I could attend university. And I believed them because I knew that the opportunity to have an athletic scholarship would remove the biggest barrier I had in my life. And for someone like me, who I'm the first person in my family to graduate high school, I didn't have a network of family and friends that ever attended university. It was the it was the kind of hope and optimism I needed in my life to believe that one day I could come here and be a student athlete. And it's an incredible tool for a university to be able to use to make sure that we can help teachers and coaches in our community to say to athletes that have barriers that one day they can be a student athlete here and a scholarship does that. say that, and I say this with the deepest sincerity, that every single job that I've gotten since leaving the university came because I was a student athlete at, the, at this institution. And that would include being elected um, for MLA in Point Douglas, a neighborhood that has given me so much that I get to represent a neighborhood like that in the legislature. That came because of the the relationships, the commitment, the hard work, the dedication of the, the people here at the university. It instilled a set of principles and values in me of who I am today. The people who helped me get to where I was today and to be able to have a university degree, they didn't ask for anything in return. I think their hope for me would be that one day that I would give back in the same way if the opportunity existed and so I feel grateful and blessed for the generosity of people who literally changed my life. Again, I'm just so grateful for the people who took the time to donate and to give to the athletic scholarship and helped change my life and many other people who never thought university was a possibility for them.